A while back, I discovered this blog called Unfancy.com. It's all about having a minimalist wardrobe, a capsule wardrobe. Here's the concept. You have a minimal amount of clothing per season, like somewhere between 30 and 40 pieces. Those pieces include dresses, tops, pants or skirts, jackets, and shoes. You choose items that you love, and then you get rid of everything else. I am not a sentimental girl. I throw things away all the time. I like things to be useful. If my kid breaks a toy, I throw it out. I don't have a box full of high school letters. And those mixtapes you all have saved? Mine are in the garbage. I really appreciate and have been working to adopt a minimalist lifestyle. You know, stuff doesn't make you happy. Experiences make you happy. In the past, I found myself staring at my overflowing closet thinking, I have nothing to wear. Nothing looked good on me. Nothing went together. I always felt like my outfit needed work. I bought clothes, cheap clothes, impulsively, and I rarely felt satisfied with my purchases. The madness needed to stop. I wanted to be happy about my wardrobe. I wanted to look at my closet, put something on, feel like I looked great, and move on with my day. I have two kids and a busy, full life. Who's got time to try on 17 outfits before feeling confident? So I went for it. I took the bull by the horns and cleaned out my closet. I followed the unfancy guidelines pretty closely, and the whole thing only took me about half a day. When I came out on the other end, I felt great. I've been using my capsule wardrobe for about three months, and it has resulted in exactly the feelings I was expecting. Contentment and simplicity. Here's how I did it. I literally emptied every single thing out of my closet. This was around the end of March, so I was ready to transition my wardrobe from winter to spring anyhow. Now I'm moving into summer, but the method is still the same. First, make piles. I love this and will wear it all season. I love this, but the season isn't right. Maybe, because who doesn't have a maybe pile? And I don't wear this ever. So far, my I love this and will wear it all season pile never has enough in it. So I bulk it up with some items from the maybe pile. The rest of the maybe pile I add to my I don't wear this ever pile. And then I usually make a needs list of things to get. Currently on that list is a good pair of sandals, a military style jacket, and a comfortable loose tank top. My I don't wear this pile was full of clothes that I thought were cute, but don't look good on me. Clothes that don't fit me, never have and maybe never will. Dresses I wore once and never wore again. I also added to this pile clothes that were hideous or poorly made that I continue to put on my body for lack of something better to wear. I got rid of that pile. And I mean, got rid of it. And then I have a bin for other seasonal capsules. It's labeled and lives in the attic. Right now, my wardrobe consists of the following. Three dresses, one romper, one sweater, ten other tops, three pair of shorts, four pair of pants, two jackets, and six pair of shoes. That's 30 items. Again, I have my needs list. Plus, this low number gives me the opportunity to purchase good, quality items that are intentional and that I truly love. While creating my capsule wardrobe, I went through waves of panic and peace. I thought, why am I doing this? Will this really make me happy? I can't possibly get rid of all this stuff. What will I wear? Those thoughts were quickly followed with thoughts of how good and easy it will feel to get dressed in the morning. And guess what? It is so easy. I don't regret a single thing. I love the clothes I have. Getting dressed is easy. And what's more, I've gotten more compliments on my outfits than ever before. And I got rid of my big dresser and now have more space in my bedroom. How great is that? I take better care of the clothes I do have. I think about what I'm purchasing or what I might buy. And I don't worry about my clothes or how I look ever because I know that I like and look good in the clothes I have. Vermont's a bit hard with all of its exciting temperature changes, but I'm up for the challenge. And full disclosure, you don't need to include workout clothes, pajamas, or loungy type clothes in your capsule, like the kind of clothes you wouldn't wear outside your own home. So in a pinch, I'll still throw on a sweatshirt if it gets a bit chilly. But for the most part, I stick to the capsule. If only I had that military jacket, that wouldn't be a problem. For now, I'll keep my eye out for the perfect one. Are you ready for the challenge? Comment if you need some help getting started.